hey my friend oh my god this is exciting TikTok has ads manager now not everybody has access to it but maybe you have access to it I've just been given access to it and I'm going to go set it up right now I'm going to live with you and I'm going to learn it as I go along and let's do that and let's go set up the TikTok ads manager we'll be right just after this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets all right like I said this is exciting I've been wondering if I could ever try some ads on TikTok obviously when you're the first when you're in the first in the trial you have advantages to that right so it's definitely important to jump in if you can get access to it right now um I don't even remember how I got access maybe we'll look into that uh during this episode too but before we go there I want to tell you if you're listening to the audio you're definitely going to want to go check out the video at cis291 dot jsgagnon.com to go check out the blog post and the video where I'm actually going to show you what the TikTok ad manager looks like how to set it up and all that good stuff all right so let's go and share the screen so you can see the email I just got from TikTok ads manager right so it says TikTok ads manager now available to you um I'm trying to remember how I actually requested access to it but basically this is kind of what the email looks like right it says uh, TikTok for business TikTok ads manager is now available for you uh, we are thrilled to be emailing you today with some big news TikTok ads manager self-serve platform is now available for a select group of CA I imagine that means Canadian not California advertisers and you're invited to participate in our early access program Woohoo! awesome right with TikTok ads manager you'll be able to easily define your target audience design your ad creatives and decide when and where to show your ads to your potential customers now I have no idea what the minimum uh, cost is what you can you know any any of that so let's just see what that looks like if I'm going to just click on this invitation link and open that in a new window and we're just going to make that visible whoops I didn't do that right I want to go here I want to make this so that you can see the whole thing okay so welcome to TikTok ads manager all right so first of all I gotta sign up I'm actually logged in I'm uh let's see is there not a no I guess I have to put in my okay let's just put that in here my email address of course you all know what that is now my password I'm oh no this is a new account okay so this is signing up all right sign up with phone uh, no I guess it doesn't matter okay sign up with email all right so I'm going to put in a password in here this is to view it okay so I don't want to see it I don't want I don't want to so anybody sees what the password is let's just see here all right let's see let's just go over here okay let me just uh, sorry I gotta do something over here all right okay so my password verification code okay send my code I guess that goes to my email so I've got an email let's go into my email I'm gonna have a new email here for that see that came in uh, I guess not maybe all my mail TikTok ads manager click funnels so didn't get it yet didn't receive the code so please search TikTok in your inbox to TikTok ads please check your spam okay well let's go check the spam my inbox maybe it takes a while to get it let's search for TikTok TikTok the urban planet no nope, don't need that hmm 
that's sad that I'm not getting it yet I would I would like to set this up maybe what I'm going to do is going to pause the recording and then when I get it I'll come back let's do that okay so there it is and actually the, what happened is I had a typo in my email that's why I wasn't getting it but basically I got the code right here for my TikTok account let's go in here send it in here I actually had a typo in my email that's why it wasn't coming so I got that there verification code click I'm, I'm happy with this uh oh that's nice <laughs> they're getting an error <laughs> I wonder if they're using uh click funnels because right now there's actually a problem with click funnels so again I'll pause this we'll come back when this is fixed okay it looks like click funnels is back so let me see if this works send the code again uh, go back to the email over here refresh there was an error with the but anyways so there's the new oh is it not the same code I just had oh hold on maybe it's uh yeah okay looks like the same code maybe it's based on my email or something okay so now there you go so click here sign up let's see what happens that's interesting so that means they were actually using click funnels I'm going to save that because I don't want to have to worry about it country Canada let's make my time zone it doesn't really matter business name let's just it's just my business name right currency Canadian my phone number and then uh, welcome accept it oops please check and enter again okay what does he want it doesn't want dashes maybe there you go no dashes okay register create an account is created dashboard and this is my id and okay so now we have entered the platform there's some there's some little notifications here what are they ads creation restructure remove to add so these are just uh, okay mark all is red I'm not really sure <clears throat> okay company website so this is my blog <coughs> all right industry let's see I'm in what what am I in life service professional retail retail and e-commerce wow social e-commerce I have no idea billing address tax information okay so I'm gonna well, let's see manually add balance before delivering your ads okay so will not be able to change it payment type hmm. do not work in an agency no all right postal code province Prince Edward Island okay so I'm just going to pause the video right now and I'm going to fill this in because that's information I don't want in the video so okay so that's done and the next step that they asked me for is enter billing add a balance so let's see what happens when I do that click on here amount 5500 okay let's just put 100 see what happens I guess it's going to probably ask me for a credit card right I would think let's see what happens total amount 115 Canadian oh interesting credit card number expiration date and all that stuff okay so again I'm going to pause the video obviously you don't want my credit card in the recording all right so the payment was successful it's going to go back now to the um to the actual TikTok advertising page let's see what happens it's loading up I'm pretty sure that I requested access to that by going into ads.tiktok.com and just entering it right so we've got this payment method documents account setup all right so now what so campaigns I guess this is where I would create a new campaign let's go in here so traffic send more people to a de destination of your website or app buying type auction anyways let's just see what happens I don't I have no idea whether this is going to be worth video views hmm traffic name budget I want a budget for sure um fifty dollars a day oh wow okay how about lifetime fifty dollars you can't spend less so let's make it fifty and 
then let's see conversions drive people send more people to destination your website let's see what happens continue now who do I send this to right so the website what's the website use TikTok pixel there's a TikTok pixel interesting optimize us please select a pixel I don't have any pixels can I create one choose the event you would like to optimize for that is being aligned with your ads mm -hmm. so where do I say estimated reach six to eight k so there must be a so create new so this is an ad promotion type placement creative type audience gender age I'm going to say can I do these different more than one age group yeah let's just do that language English definitely want them to be English English oh okay English right here whoops all right video related actions I don't know what any of that stuff is right select time period to include actions from hmm. ah. okay well first I guess I have to figure out who the audience is okay choose audiences to include or exclude the custom audience by uploading to create a lookalike audience based on who you'd like okay I'm not sure what is that we don't have saved audiences can I create a new audience I can look at that I can create a new audience create an audience okay so let's say I accept let's what kind of audience do I want create a custom you can create a custom audience by uploading customer files on user and kitty in your in your app okay so let's do that let's go and say app activity who downloaded your app or took specific actions no that's not what I want list of people who saw clicked or engaged with your content there you go I want that clicked last 90 days event I want them to see that they saw a two second video I'm not sure what that is ad group if no specific audience based on all ad groups okay audience name so two second video views okay let's see what that does right confirm your audience that is being uploaded so I'm not sure what he's what this is like is it against my TikTok account how does it know that it's my TikTok account this is a different your personal account can I connect to my actual account info can I connect to my uh, actual TikTok account here because that's really what I want I want people who engage in my TikTok account right so let's see if that works <coughs> it's loading up something my account if I go back to here and I look at so this is going to be the audience refresh my audiences included uh, why is this not loading up mm -mm -mm. so what is it that I automated creative optimization so it cannot be changed hmm it's just uh quite the thing right but still anyways I guess the ad is the part you got to decide what you're doing first right like it's a website I don't know about this create new use existing promotion type the placement creative type the targeted location I don't want location Canada well okay Canada I guess I can put I guess I have to specify something in Canada let's say United States let's say 
that's it they don't have United UK or they don't have anything else well I guess that's the only countries that they allowed ads in so far the actual ad delivery may vary depending on the supported locations different placements okay gender and then it doesn't matter English yes interests what is it education babies beauty education news and entertainment somebody who's interested in travel who's interested in tech and electronics financial services there you go too narrow really okay let's get the financial services out of there then really wow why does it say too narrow too narrow okay well whatever then no no, no limit and maybe because of the age group okay um video related actions I'm not sure what that's supposed to mean interest in behavior people who commented people commented on what category creativity fashion performance what's performance who watched funny or talented videos or other performance videos within a specified time period in the past society transportation about transportation so how did the okay society let's just put society too narrow eh who liked watch the end see that's pretty crazy eh? okay let's do that I don't so daily budget so isn't there a budget didn't I put a budget someplace hmm Oh, user can okay user can comment on your ads okay let's go back to here did that fit? oh that's still loading oh wow okay I guess there's some sort of issue with that ah there we go tell us business primary permission tax document payment transaction brand safety basic information good to go account name what is that can I change my account name hmm. oh that's nice my address shows up there okay business information primary contact okay so let's go back to my assets I got this audience so audience ID yeah but I mean still what is the is this a new account does that create a new account can I add okay let's try to add this one this is an ad account okay it has to be an ad account hmm well anyway so let's see okay let's keep going and see what happens well actually I'm already on here let's not worry about that okay so this one here let's see so now I'm going through here okay so let's see what else so I don't know about this TikTok pixel I don't have a pixel can I create a let's create a new pixel I guess I need a pixel okay skip you can set a series of events okay what's next and then create pixel okay fine okay so create pixel pixel is a website plugin with google embedded in the header I agree okay manually install pixel pixel name so TikTok name pixel let's just call it like this so install pixel manually install pixel code 
okay so can I do that to install the pixel helper check your pixel so I can just add this to my to my website copy pixel code let's go to my blog let's just uh, I'm just editing another page here I'm just going to make sure I have the right categories first uh -huh. okay now I'm going to go back into my header code into my header insert headers and footers I'm going to add that to there put that in here this is going to be the tiktok pixel there we go tiktok pixel okay uh, save okay so now I have the pixel on my blog let's go back to the tiktok that's gone complete e-commerce events choose the scenario that best you charge your business goals I don't really know form submission let's just do that event type event name currency okay I have no idea what I'm doing here okay tracking method okay so this will be okay do that okay maybe I need to put the right name there okay so that's gone loading that up now what do I want in here I don't even know what are you talking about that's right let's go to my oops I want to go to the site that's the site did I type it wrong update did I I don't know maybe I had a typo but anyways uh, let's just say complete details does not have any rules cannot be open why is he saying that make sure you have installed the pixel helper then refresh the page to set if the page still cannot be open click the button below to open a new page and define the event I mean it's there it's loading up why why is this not okay maybe I have to have an event destination count the user visits let's just say click events add a rule finally each event I have no idea <laughs> this is kind of silly to have to do this I just want to I just want people to visit the page right just do this add page browsing rule page url contains Jean-Serge Gagnon there save that complete has a rule that needs to be saved well I just saved it so maybe I had another one okay cancel this one complete no does not have any rules it does have a rule it's right here change tracking method details page view button click form okay css selector info no idea I'll save okay well there you go created successfully okay I don't know what I just did <laughs> it's like completely uh anyways I, I just want to get through this and actually create 
so there's got these events here waiting for the first event test events Mm. yeah I did download it okay enter your url to generate a QR code that can scan your phone oh, okay so generate whoops generate QR code enter value oh okay I have my url here still yes okay so let's see if I go in my TikTok app apparently I'm supposed to scan that I don't know what they are how am I supposed to do that so scan scan there so it's loading up in my phone here it's going to my blog through the scan of that code and then it says look at that there you go I got it okay good okay so that's going now go back to here and let's select the pixel that's the one here optimization event button click I have no idea no idea if that's going to do anything okay so now placement automatic placement creative type audience demographics languages behavior society no idea what that does 15 days uh, daily budget let's say lifetime budget of 50 there then from schedule from 8 to January okay one month so I don't know right uh specific tag specific time hmm. that's interesting you can set wow let's say eight oh I can do that too these boxes of time huh it's kind of cool I can do eight to let's say 9 p.m whoops there you go okay let's do that optimization go bit control get the most results lowest cost what's this supposed to be show more options cost per click okay let's do next see what happens now I guess I oh lifetime budget your budget must be at least 620 oh okay well let's change this to just a few days then because it's supposed to be 50 dollars a day isn't it that's a little bit too high for me to spend on something I'm just trying out especially if it's just to get people to my blog so mm, what if I change this to January 4th okay next 340 okay let's make it just a few days then from the 18th to the 22nd next eighty dollars 21st sixty dollars the 20th so just two days that's crazy they want they want 60 or so a, I guess 40 a day or something so top buzz hello tango interesting okay so click a one minute guide to help you understand how to get your ads approved add name video from library what's my library I don't have any right so upload I got to go find my TikTok videos I believe I have them all on here actually it's in here it'll be in here TikTok videos I'm pretty sure I have them in here but I don't have a recent TikTok video hmm. these are all TikTok videos from a while ago right 2020 11, 16 I have no idea what that was 
I should probably copy a video from I have no idea which ones these are right it should be a snapchat video probably mm. a uh, quick one minute guide to help you understand how to get your ads approved okay add details video so we're 30 minutes in let me just get let me just get the latest video here from my phone plug my phone into the laptop okay and I'm just going to get one of the last ones I did um, and let's see if I go in here I go here open up a new tag I tell you my computer is and really annoying like go away it's beep beeping me about this stuff that I just okay anyways okay so if I go into uh this computer on the phone obviously it's not is that it here no the phone it's not connected <sighs> I don't know why this ca it must be my cable right It's like installing this this is not this is not normal I'm supposed to have a I'm not I'm not very lucky am I today so let's pause the video and get that sorted out all right so I got all the files from my phone to the laptop and now what I've decided to do is I'm actually going to use this episode over here which is episode 283 which was basically asking people to subscribe to get my ebook right so I want to have something that I can actually maybe get them on my list or something right so that's kind of what the, this episode is all about so let's go and get the video for that in here I'm going to upload that it's going to be into my TikTok videos the reason I'm I could have used the snapchat videos because they don't have any in images or anything on there which maybe I could have added but anyways I'm going to use a TikTok video see what happens uh, in my TikTok videos from this 2012 this this is the one here I actually was sort of hoping I didn't do a crazy video for that day but anyways it turns out this is the one maybe that'll be good anyways so that's the one here and we're going to upload it and that's going to take a little bit so I might pause the video again let's see how that how long that takes see if it's uh, it says uploading so let's pause the video right now and come back when it's done so halfway there as you can see my internet is not the fastest it's got uh 48 megs six megabits a second there it's halfway done so we'll come back when it's finished uh, so it's showing optimizing now I'm not sure how long that takes maybe it, it won't be long so let's just see but if it takes too long I'll pause again but um, come back when it's done there we go it's done success I'm going to confirm it that's my video and okay so this video does not match the requirements of the following placement pango oh, I don't know what pango is menu adjust according to the requirements 
resolution this is basically a format that it's a TikTok video so <laughs> okay click this link to optimize different aspects size soundtrack and effects in order to improve its performance okay quick optimization hmm text and link okay first of all I need the link to my blog right so this is whoops not here it's over here is it this is the link to the blog that I wanted to go to so the link this is the URL right here learn more what is it learn more shop now sign up learn more is what I want profile image oh so I want my own my own profile image which is the one I have in my TikTok so let's go into my images right here profile pictures and let's just take my square one the 500 maybe that one's probably fine and there you go yep that's good <coughs> okay uh text hmm oh look at that you can see right there learn how to get the success you want online easy to follow 12 step guide mm -hmm. display name get the results you want all right so what else is there let's see quick optimization what is, so what does that do they say you can add change the music and things like that the sound's already on it so oh what's he doing he's optimizing all that that looks like that's going to take a little bit let's pause the video again so we can come back when it's done okay so after it's done here it says optimize video for different things I'm not even sure what that means uh what is it I'm supposed to do here it looks like I can't I'm supposed to click on one of these optimize video three optimize video one so I have no idea what it's asking me because it I can't even press to confirm here So I can't even select it I, I guess there's a create more here what's that going to do no I don't want to do that okay let's cancel I don't know what that does it probably doesn't matter that much so the follow look at that that's like why is this there must be a way for me to tie my account into this ad account right but anyways we're going to see what happens maybe it's because when I registered it it wasn't using the same email but no it's the same email hmm anyways I'm just going to see am I legally authorized yes I am I, I as legally authorized under my company authorized TikTok yeah that's fine TikTok main pixel third-party tracking settings impression tracking I'm not sure what that is click tracking so there you go let's see what happens submit it submit the ad congratulations your campaign will is will now be reviewed so I don't know how long it takes and we'll see what happens and uh yeah so I'll probably be uh, letting you know what happened to this in another episode at some time in the past and maybe we'll talk more about how I can integrate that with my current TikTok account and see if there's a if there's a way to link them together because I mean obviously if this is a new account with only one thing uh anyways in the end I want people to go to my blog and subscribe so that's the goal so hopefully this works out all right we'll see you in the next episode this has been course income secrets the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom some of your friends need to hear this message so don't forget to share for more content like this go to courseincomesecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon until next time